Hello and welcome back. In this lesson, we will learn about the AND logical operator. The AND logical operator performs operation on an array of two or more expressions and retrieves the document which satisfies all of the expression in the array. If the first expression evaluates to false, MongoDB will not evaluate the remaining expression. Let us try an example. First, find any musician who plays the drums and was born in 1998. So in order for us to write this query and to get the correct result, we need to find musicians who plays the drums and, and was born in 1998. Both of these conditions must match, must be true in order for this query to run. Let us try. We are working with the musician collection. First, we can look at everything that exists within the musician collection. Then, we can go ahead and write the query. So to write a query using the AND logical operator, we will start it like any ordinary query. DB, the name of the collection, find, find, this time we need to use AND, A-N-D, AND. We are looking for more than one value from within an array. It is an array, so we need to have a square bracket. Within the square bracket, let's first identify the first value we are looking for. The first value has to do with someone who plays drums. Drums is stored under instruments. Instrument drums. Second, we are looking for someone who was born in 1988. Born 1988. Close in curly bracket then close in two more curly brackets to close the statement, close in parenthesis. So in this case, we are looking for two values. Both of these values must be true. Someone must play the drums and they must, must have been born in 1988. Hit enter. And we return with an error. So let us troubleshoot this together and find out exactly what error did we make. So let's type the sequence again. DB musicians, musicians, period, find, open parenthesis, open curly bracket, and, semicolon, square bracket, curly bracket, instrument, semicolon, drums, close in bracket, comma, open bracket, born, semicolon, 1988, close in bracket, close in curly brackets, close in parenthesis. So it looks like everything is correct.
let us go ahead and hit enter and see what happens. Oh, I see what happens. I see the mistake. Right here. There's a closing bracket for instrument and drums, and there's a closing bracket for born in 1998, right here. Except I need to have a closing square bracket, and I didn't. So, space, closing square bracket, closing curly bracket, closing parenthesis. So, let us look at this again. Open parenthesis, closing parenthesis, open curly bracket, closing curly bracket, open square bracket, closing square bracket, open and close, open and close. Everything matches. Hit enter, and this should work. And there you go. We we'll return with ID2 Larry Kent who plays the drums and keyword and was born in 1988. Now we took a few extra minutes there because we needed to debug this code. We needed to verify exactly what was the error and the error was instead of having a close in square bracket, I had an additional close in curly bracket. As a developer, regardless if you're a new developer or an expert who has many years in the field, you will make errors. And you also have to learn to take the time and backtrack your code. Be able to look at the code and find out exactly what the error is. Sometimes the council will give you a hint. And it did. It says syntax error missing square bracket. I see it now. I didn't catch it immediately and I didn't think of looking for it immediately because I thought let's just go and look at the code and backtrack everything that we did together. So sometimes look at the error messages, read them, and try to understand to see if you can debug whenever you're faced with an error. Let us continue. Query number two, find any musician who's play, who plays the drums and was born before 1990. So this is almost the same as the previous one, except there's a small condition. The condition is, was born before 1990. Please pause the video now and see if you can solve this query on your own. When you're ready, hit continue and we will solve it together. Now, assuming that you paused the video and you tried to solve that query, let us solve it together. We are looking for any musician who plays the drums and was born before 1990. So we can hit arrow up to get back to the same query we wrote previously, except this time we can backspace until we get to born. When we get to born, add a semicolon and a curly bracket. Inside the curly bracket, use the abbreviation, the comparison operator, less than. Less than is the same as before. Less than, semicolon, 1990. Close it, curly bracket, square bracket, curly bracket, close in parenthesis. So this time we are looking for musicians who plays the drums and who was born less than 1990. In other words, born before 1990. Hit enter. And it looks like I made another error. Let me see. Born.
less than 1990. Close in bracket, close in bracket, square bracket, close in curly bracket, close in parenthesis. And my error was a close in bracket here. I left one out because now we have open bracket, open bracket. So we need to have close in bracket, close in bracket. Go ahead and hit enter and this is guaranteed to work. And there we have it. Now we have information about musicians who plays the drums and was born before 1990. In the next video, we will continue learning about the OR operator. I'll see you then.